Hello, my beautiful nerds. I'm Paul as well. This is Windrider. Today we're playing Wild Rift, and today's champion will be Graves. So I've been playing a lot as Graves recently, so I want to discuss my build strategy. So whenever whenever I play Graves, I'm going to have essentially two builds that I'm either going to choose from. I'm either going to have a, a tanky AD carry build or a, just a traditional AD carry build. In both builds, I'm going to have four items that are going to be in central with both, but then the last two items are going to be swappable depending on which build I want to get. Those four items are going to be Static Shiv, Infinity Edge, the Gluttonous Boots, and Guardian Angel. So Static Shiv and Infinity Edge are going to be is they're gonna give me damage and attack speed and also they're gonna help me out with getting the crit damage that I, I really want in an AD carry. Gluttonous Boots will give me a little bit of life steal or physical vamp and then Guardian Angel will obviously give me some armor and attack but also especially the revive. If I'm gonna go for the traditional AD carry I'm gonna the last two items are gonna be Mortal Reminder and Bloodthirster. Bloodthirster will give me a small little bit of shield but it's also gonna give me a lot of attack and more lifesteal and mortal reminder will also give me attack it's going to also apply some grievous wounds but it's also going to give me armor penetration but if i'm going to go for a bulkier build i'm going to go for death dance and black cleaver both these items give hp but black cleaver rather than doing pure armor penetration it's going to reduce the opponent's armor every time i do physical damage and death dance will give also HP, but it's also going to provide a little bit of lifesteal. So these are going to be more bulkier builds rather than pure offensive builds. So whether I choose tanky or offensive AD carry is going to be really dependent on team composition. If the opposing team is really offense heavy or if my team is really squishy, then I'm going to be building uh, more, The I'm going to be building the bulky, the tanky AD carry. If my team needs a lot more offense, like we're all tanks, or if I'm really ahead, I'm gonna, or if my team is really ahead, I'm probably gonna build the offensive AD carry instead. But just because the offensive AD carry doesn't really, doesn't provide as much HP as the tanky carry, it's gonna be a little bit uh, riskier on the defensive side. So if I'm or if our team is already really ahead, then I would go for the more offensive AD carry. And in this match, I specifically went with the tanky AD carry instead. Their team didn't really have that many um, tanks in general. They all were all pretty offensive. So I decided to go with the tank, the tanky AD carry instead, just to counteract their offense. And that's my build strategy with Graves. For the rest of the video, please enjoy the match. Middle Damn turret is under attack. Ideas. Attack the dragon. Bottom turret is under attack. Bottom turret is under attack. 
Lane, shut down. Everyone's a hero till you shoot off a leg or two. <laughs> What are you playing at? Enemy slain. Ally slain. Enemy double kill. Enemy triple kill. Enemy rampage. Top turret is under attack. Always trouble. On my way. Top turret is under attack. Top turret is under attack. Everyone's a hero. To your shoot is off unstoppable. Dragon has spawned. You are legendary. End of the last. What are you playing? <laughs> Shut down. Enemy double. Enemy slain. Trouble. Ally slain.
the line. Turret, Turret is under attack. Engage. You have slain an enemy. Inhibitor turret is under attack. End of the line. Easy, partner. We have Easy slain partner. an enemy. End of the line.
And that does it for today's match. If you guys like this video, please give it a like and also subscribe to help support the channel. This has been Wind Rider, and I shall see you all next video. Peace out, you beautiful nerds.